Okay. I think I fixed it. Yes, I did. Okay. We're good now. I don't know what was happening there. It says, uh, it said my Twitch was taking up, uh, 100% of my GPU power. Uh, very strange. I was posting to Twitter, uh, telling everybody my which was messing up. <laughs> okay. Now that my Twitch is fixed and I'm actually here on Twitch and not in the non-void realm, I can actually get started. Uh, also, the, the music was fine, so we're just going to jump right into the game. Though, I am going to need a cup of water. I am sorely dying right now of dehydration. This... Oh, no, nope, it's doing it again. God damn it. What is happening here? They shouldn't be pulling this much uh, GPU power. God damn it. How laggy is this? Not too bad, but once I get in game, it's gonna be really laggy if this doesn't fix itself. God damn. I don't know why this keeps happening to me. It's like, uh. Twitch keeps changing their settings. want to play the game. I can hear my computer struggling too. Maybe I gotta restart my computer. Well, let's see. Let's see what I can do. If it gets too bad, then I'm going to have to restart my computer. Uh, Alright. Uh, let's go to Northern Forest. Because I played this game about almost 100 hours. Uh, trying to think of a good name here. Oh, you know what? Actually, I think I might figure it out. Oh, no, never mind. Hmm. Let's, uh... Let's name it... Day After... 420. There we go. The day after 420. <laughs> very, uh, very simplistic name. I forgot they had an intro. Attention Pioneer, 
The following instructional video is a summary of your impending duties as an exoplanetary pioneer for Fixit Incorporated. Yep. Fixit pioneers have three cyclical assigned pillars of work to ultimately accomplish project assembly. Use Wait. provided blueprints to build the necessary buildings. I just heard myself for a second. Chart the planet that was weird. and gather resources to provide desired results and improve your infrastructure. Make sure to report any unusual discoveries to R and D for analysis. That's me. Expand your factories, outposts, and pipelines through automation and augmentation. That's Everyone's going to hate Get me. To I'm going to place these conveyor effective. belts in the worst possible spots. Warning, planetfall imminent. Please remain seated during full procedure. Atmospheric entry in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Planetfall procedure initialized. I trust in the company. I'm not even scared. Also, I can't even move. suit is at 100%. Uh, immediately. <laughs> Remember, efficiency first. Godspeed. Alright, well I hate these guys. Welcome to Planet Massage 2 ABB, your designated sector in the binary star system of Akija. Note. Obj Let me do stuff. Oh my god. Calm down, game. Guess because it was just loading in. Alright. Let's mantle this. All oh wait, did I select a tutorial? Communication oh no. Is recorded and stored in the codex, including these steps. <laughs> Doing the tutorial is in a hundred hours of gameplay. Second objective. Please ensure you have your Fixit Incorporated Xeno Zapper equipped before leaving the drop zone. Note. According to Fixit regulations, every pioneer should have leaves. access to a means of defense against extraterrestrial threats. The one thing that's really good about this game is you don't have to constantly press E. You can just click on them. Third objective. Please familiarize yourself with the resource scanner to find iron. Note, the acquisition of iron is considered essential in preparation for all future objectives. Well, there's stone right there. Okay. Uh, we're gonna need a lot of iron. So on 10 straight over to that one actually would be better than that one we're gonna head over to this one hopefully the uh, resources themselves are pure as we run we're just gonna pick up everything Because we need so much, uh, biofuel in this game. Make sure I'm going the right way. Pretty sure I am. Yep. Yeah. Well, it actually seems like my OBS is, like almost peaking but it's right below 
So, uh, we're just gonna leave it as is, and hopefully it's good for the rest of the stream. Uh, you know, this game is kind of the epitome of, uh, this place is beautiful, but you know what would make it even better? If we put a Walmart right there. All right, we got a bunch of resource deposits. We'll see which ones are pure, and then we'll use those ones for now. These are my favorite creatures. They're so cute. I wish I had one in real life. This one's pure. Really thought you could sneak up on me, huh? No. If we take this objective, the resources salvaged from the drop pod will be consumed. Stop moving weirdly. Caution. Ensure there we go. the hub is built on spacious open terrain close to the presence of iron sources. Failure to do so will likely result in non-optimal progress. Alright, let's build the hub. Probably gonna put the hub like here. The remains of this creature might shed light on how to increase chances of survival. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Crafting bench. Oh wait, you don't have anything yet. Congratulations. You have unlocked hub feature manual craft bench. Don't have those yet. I never actually did it this way before. Okay. So I need both of those. Congratulations. You have unlocked building workshop, equipment, portable miner, inventory, additional slots. Hub feature, personal storage. Sixth objective, complete hub upgrade to, note, portable miners Open require no power and will mine a node until their inventory is full. Note, multiple portable miners can be used on a single node. Okay. How much do I need again? Four iron plate. I mean, two iron plates and two rod. I mean, four rods. And I cannot speak. Once we get the factory started, I'm gonna grab myself some water and then we'll keep going. I say that once we get the factory started. Do you know how long it takes to do that? <laughs> it never ends. Look at him. Beautiful creature. Right. Forgot you had to hold it. Okay. Start it up. This just makes it easier on myself by doing it like this in the beginning because this actually just allows it to fully automate it in the beginning and then you can just pick it back up and then actually start crafting it. So I'm just going to throw two down right now and then I'm going to start crafting everything I need for them. Because then I can just let this harvest and this harvest and then pick it up when I actually just need to, uh, oops, do that, do that, uh, 
when I can actually put the real miners on them. Now, how much did I need to actually start doing this? Was it 10? Yep, 10 of that, 20 of the other. We got six of those plates. All right, now we just need 18 iron rods. Okay. Upgrade. Now we got one of these guys, which is the biomass burner, feature, which is great. biomass burner. Scanner feature, copper. New buildings and recipes, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. I have a smelter unlocked. Seventh objective. And power Complete lines. hub upgrade three. Note: Connect buildings to a biomass burner for power. Note, buildings such as the smelter Actually, require a recipe to be set. Oh no, I need wire. Advice, uh, automate the smelting process and use portable miners for optimal results. Let me make another thingy real quick. Alright, let's see where copper's at. Should be nearby. Yeah. There is an enemy over there. Let me go beat him to death. There's a lot more copper that way. My god. At least this is a uh, pure vein. sure I have enough. Should be good. Yeah, I usually skip the tier 1 buildings like this and like, well, it's technically tier 0, but I usually skip it because uh I already know how to play this game, like, really, really well. Don't really need, uh, that type of tutorial. But I guess it's good to actually, like, do it and see how it's like. Because i never actually seen all of this. When I first played, I just went immediately right into the game. Throw these in there. Sometimes when uh, there's just too much to do in game, I'll just like throw something onto my like space bar and just start crafting for like 20 minutes straight. There we go. Tier 4. Need concrete and wire. But I got the constructor and smelters now. Congratulations. I you do have unlocked want the scanner feature first miners limestone. before we do that. New buildings and recipes, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Eighth objective. Complete hub right. upgrade 4. Note. 
Use power poles to expand the power network for optimal results. Got all that. Grab all that. Gotta run all the way back over there. And grab all this. I think I was accidentally breathing into the mic. <laughs> God damn it. One second. I'm gonna I'm gonna mute myself while I do this fix real quick. Okay. That should be a little bit better. Hopefully it's not too loud. No, it's, I think it's still picking it up for some reason. Either that or it's picking up somebody talking inside my house. Five iron plates and ten concrete. So we'll have to make another miner. Where the concrete's at. Oh, a bunch. Great. Perfect, actually. Is this one a pure vein? This one is. Hello. Die. Alright, I can't hit him. He keeps hitting me. Oh, there's two of them. that the distractions are gone. Keep mining. I don't. All right. I always press the wrong button. There we go. Don't really need that much limestone. I don't think. Now until we get the, to the, uh, I think the next tier, that the concrete really needs to start being produced a lot faster. Same with the iron. Yes, is a constructor. Oh wait, no, I need reinforced iron plates. Can I make those? I can. Let me do that real quick. Alright. And... Those. I 
Okay, I do need a smelter as well. That's what I'm gonna do first. Do this. Some more cable. So then I don't have to sit here and make a billion iron ingots. One off. All right. <laughs> oh, I can't actually make. Uh, the post yet. Never mind. I thought I would be able to. Crap. Did that for nothing. like this. Can't make biomass yet, so we will use uh, flowers. Gonna throw these into there. You will make iron plates for me. While I do this, I hope you guys like those sounds. That's all you're going to be hearing 90% of the game. Copper soon. So much iron plates is probably one of the uh, the main things that you want to focus in game for a very long time probably all the way up to tier four or five until you actually uh, reach the reinforcement iron plates moment and then you'll have to like double your production anyway unless you get the uh, other blueprints which actually I probably should have unlocked I don't really like hunting down for 40 minutes just to find one blueprint. But it's all right. We will uh, we'll roll with it. Congratulations, okay. you have unlocked building conveyor belts and poles. Inventory additional slots. Ninth objective 
Complete hub upgrade 5. Note, portable miners cannot be connected to conveyor belts. Advice, we when planning the construction of buildings, but note the placement of conveyor belts. Limestone is really belts. just meant for concrete. There's really, like, maybe one or two other resources in the game that need limestone. Copper and the actual concrete compound. Well, that actually builds the other one. I think it requires two wire per cable. So we'll go all the way up to 100. I done this run before with uh, just trying to use factories and my god does that take so long and I was thinking about doing it but uh, using just factories and no other component of crafting uh, of course with a tier 1 skip um, is possible it just takes forever anytime you want to actually uh, have just like one extra ingredient or one extra thing you can't craft it you have to switch over your whole factory just to do it <laughs> very chill you just do what you need to do to build a factory Congratulations. So now I can actually start you building these guys. Building Miner Mark 1. Building Storage Container. So I don't need feature these. Additional Biomass Burner. Tenth Objective. Complete Hub Upgrade 6. Note. There are no notes. So first you want to focus on iron. Then you want to focus on concrete. Then you want to focus on copper. At least in my opinion. Okay. So, we need this first. And I already have 10 plates, so I put down this guy. Oh no, I need 10 concrete. My bad. Let's do it that way real quick. We 
have conveyors, so I can set that up. We're gonna deconstruct both of these. And this. This down. Smelter down. The constructor down. And since we don't have storage yet, we're just gonna have to leave it. by accident. <laughs> so for this game, you want to be able to uh, move your products as fast as they can, but also keep in mind that your products can only move as fast as your conveyors can. So we want iron plates for this one. Uh, I don't have a splitter yet. I could make another smelter, but even if I did, I again don't have another splitter. So let's keep it like that until we reach the amount we need. Um. Now we're gonna make a, another miner for limestone. I'm gonna go up to 20. Is this last one to be built and then we'll have all three miners and then we can start putting on the additives that we need for it like the constructors and such I needed more iron plates. Could probably reach it from here. Nope, cannot. It's on a slope. Powered by flettles, I mean, flettles. Powered by petals and a dream. Okay. How much did we get so far? Two. Perfect. That means we can go make some reinforced plates. wire I need uh, concrete for the posts So I need 
a wire. Got it. Okay. Here's a smelter. That. some more cable and then we'll have two of the beginning machines set up and ready to go smelter for that. Never mind. And that's all good. I need a smelter for this one though. For the copper, usually you could produce more through the copper versus the iron. Which is good. Um, I need more wire. Connect two through this one, and then one out one so I, then I can connect the last iron one over there. Need to make another constructor. four machines that need set up. Oh, I'm missing one wire. Let's do this. Once I can start producing wire at bulk, I'll be good.
which one broke? Probably the wood one. Oh, nope, this one did Oh, is it too much? It might be too much power draw. That's kind of a mess. That's gonna work. Gonna keep them organized, basically. Let's uh, pick up some things here. good area actually it's uh surprisingly uh has everything in such a small zone all right it's uh perhaps more concrete I can actually just normally click this. Nope. Doesn't work. I tried. I was about to play this game like an idle clicker. We finished the tier zero hub and we're gonna be going up to tier one. Congratulations, you have unlocked building space elevator, building biomass burner, heart, biomass. Motivational message, congratulations, you succeeded in every provided task. On behalf of Fixit Incorporated, I thank you for your current and future service. Additional knowledge, the hub terminal has been converted to give access to milestones there to ensure you progress along Fixit approved protocols. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Note, future developments should be aimed at constructing the space elevator and as such initiating project assembly. Good luck. So we want to focus on trying to get our logistics up first. Uh, make sure we get a splitter system. Uh, afterwards, we want to focus on trying to get a uh, solid biofuel. And then I guess we can focus the rest. Because logistics level two is not going to happen for a while. It's going to take a little bit. Uh, we could try and do base building. It does require a lot of resources initially. We are kind of at an impasse with our power. So let's get a biomass burner first. Which is going to require... Easy items. We have to get those. Those are going to help us a lot, especially with the copper. Let's, uh, let's put down one over here. So then we can start a second lining. Uh, I do know we're going to need a actual thing here. Some solid in there. Well, not solid. Uh, regular in there. Let's put down this guy. Which we need 10 more plates. my dehydration grind apparently today because I said I was going to get water for the longest time and I still have it. Zero screws, unfortunate. Okay. So we're gonna need. I'm gonna switch this over. Let's 
cut up to 20 real quick. Okay. We're not going to need too many of those. my way which is quite unfortunate and actually makes it uh, cost more because of that <laughs> Uh, both normal and also uh, screws. How much can this hold up? Uh, 30. How about these ones? 40. Is it 40 each? No, 40. 40 in total. Okay. And we're already consuming 35, so we can't really increase that without another biomass burner. Got those. Let's, uh, let's do this real quick. We'll start making some storage crates. So then we can just start storing all this stuff. We can just run around and grab it when we need it without overflowing anything. Definitely gonna need a chainsaw soon. We're not actually overproducing this. In fact, we're like underproducing because I need so much. Put that there just in case. Okay, there's still not fuel. You can't actually convert the flowers into biomass, which is unfortunate. Okay. Now that we got three of those things out of the way. Uh, put one more over there. Which, do we even have enough resources? I do not think so. So we will make more. about to get in my way. Sir, let me place this first before I fight you. Thank you. That's what you get. Don't mess with me. I can't afford it, but I don't know if I can actually place it either. I'll try though. Alright. 
So that's doing that. So, I almost got all enough resources for everything I need so far. I'm probably gonna let them actually produce and grab some water like I said a while ago. And then, uh, I'll be right back. You're being. My god. That's gonna kick into my system and I'm gonna actually be awake today. Eighty one. My fuse. There we go. Ninety two out of one fifty, ninety nine out of one fifty. And then I probably just have to run back to the wire crate and I'll have enough. I'm gonna focus on the iron rods first. I was like, oh, I'm gonna craft more, I need more. And then I was like, wait a minute, I already have them crafting. Once I get these though, this is gonna literally increase my efficiency for building everything to like 20 times more than what I actually need. One good thing about this is almost all the resources you have uh, will be necessary in the future. So it's just like a juggling act really. Milestone reached. Conveyor belts can now merge, split, and lift to increase the complexity and efficiency of your factory. We encourage you to consider... Sorry, I gotta skip that so I can actually hit select on that. So, how much does the space elevator cost again? Ah, right. Okay. So now that we have this, uh... I can connect this biomass burner directly into this system. Uh, 
force a large amount of the power itself to uh, do multiple things that we need. The power system is going to be a little wonky for a very long time. Uh, tier 1 miner can produce at 120. Conveyor belts at level 1 and they can move at 60. Yes. These can hold 30. I can put in 2. And those require 30 a minute. So I need to... Probably have enough power for all that. Need more concrete. Select iron. Produce a constructor, which we need more of. Reinforced iron plates. Two things of iron plates being produced. And I'm gonna put a merger. Can't afford it. building nose. Now up here is going to be a little more wonky. I'm definitely going to be have to uh, Fix it freighter add another one of these. So I want to make a screw production. I also want to make a regular iron production. So... wire back. Forgot. So I need those. Need more copper. I'm also going to expand this one, but I'm going to put a uh, biomass burner, another one into the system. Uh, 
probably gonna move this for now. Probably gonna move it down here. Because I need more space. And I'm gonna make this side the screw produc production, and then the other one gonna be the normal uh, production. So I'll need two more iron plates. And, uh, how much was it? How much uh, do I have so far, actually? Six. Oh, I'm being attacked. Hey, get out of here. Hey. I hate these guys so much. What was I doing again? I forget. Oh, I think I was calculating how much I needed for my cables. Well, actually, I can produce the amount that I need right now. Wait, hold up. Maybe I should just finish it right now and then I can actually build the chainsaw. This is taking a little longer than I wanted, actually, so actually I'm, I won't. Because I do need them in the future as well. So we need four of those. Uh, I'm gonna make uh, 50 cables because I also need to connect them all. It smells like food in my house. I wonder who's cooking. That was really good. Oh, actually, I didn't eat anything today yet, so that's probably why. Okay. I'm gonna have to put another post, I'm pretty sure, for the other one. I'll let the continuation go. those and then we're gonna put another constructor right here actually you know what I don't have to do it like that because I have the splitter I can merge them into a single line and then put an actual line in between let me uh, do it like that Put a merger. And this one. This one right here because it holds 500 so I don't really uh, need to do it that way or like an actual storage crate okay my voice is cracked There we go. So I'll probably have to put another biomass burner. Uh, yes, we're almost at max maximum consumption. I'm gonna connect it to the same line. And then when everybody, when I start complaining about the power system wiring being weird, I'll have the only person to blame is me. Man, my throat is not doing so well right now, I'll tell you that. How was that? <laughs> well, you know what? Where did that one? That post there. Connect that post there. Put 
this one against this line. And then I can focus on building another copper line. So this one produces... I assume 120 as well. Yes. 60. Split it. Make two coppers. Forced iron plates. regular copper then we'll make another separate storage crate that's gonna be uh, designated for cable which we'll go like right here because I need a little bit more room to do that actually you know what I can move this forward actually get rid of this one and do the same thing I did with the last one and just create two uh, splitting lines Alright, which one died? What's going on? Those ones are fine. Oh wait, did I put any fuel on the other one? I might have not put fuel in this. <laughs> nope. Hundred. Okay. That as well. Okay, one more constructor should do it, but we're gonna do this from this one. Now I can see it. Cable. Uh, need a splitter and a merger. First the merger, and then the splitter, which we need more cable for, which hey, we're producing. Now the final one that I would have to do is this one over here, because I can construct a lot at one time. It only requires 45 limestone, and this produces 120. Oh no, it produces 60. Wait, why is that a lower uh, 
percentage. Usually it's... Oh wait, it's a skull. How did it appear? Where's another limestone? Is this one pure? This one was pure. Oh. I messed it up. You can keep doing that. I'm just gonna put this miner right back here. Wire is too long. There we go. So is this right now? 120. Okay, okay, there we go. Um... We need more cables and reinforce iron plates. You know what? What I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna finish this. I'm pretty sure I have enough resources at this point to actually start finishing this. Let me over. This. Um, I'm gonna need a merger. And then I can do these two right here. A little splitter and then a merger. <laughs> okay. And that should be good. We shouldn't be over any power draw. And now we can actually start just to uh, finish what we need to finish. it for the space elevator again 1500 400 250 500 so let's put these in that in here first so we'll know exactly how much we have to uh, spare for it That's ready. Okay. This over here. I think that's almost ready. Eat these. Finish that. Those. I think copper is going to be our slowest thing right now, which is surprising. Usually it's the fastest, but it's not going to be too bad. That. Um, that in there. Uh, so we're almost there for the concrete. 
Uh, we finished the plates. We need more rods, and we need more copper. Which I think we just finished the concrete, maybe? Almost. I have enough in my inventory to finish it. We uh, also make this, make some more biomass. Um, I just realized I don't have any more. So I'll, I'm gonna run around and start grabbing a bunch. left. Give me more for biomass. And then I can start making solid biomass afterwards, but we're gonna have to actually produce a, uh, a machine to do so. Just want to make sure I don't run out of power while I'm waiting for it. I think we should be able to get up to uh, coal by the end of this. Maybe a little bit further past that, but we'll see. It really depends on how fast everything is being produced. And I don't run into any delays. Once I finish producing this, I'm going to run around and uh, throw in the new biomass amount to uh, prevent any sort of uh, breakage between my production. ones burn biomass a little bit faster than the other ones, but it's not too bad. Alright, so what do I need? I need more screws and more wires. Biofuel will ensure maximum efficiency of biomass burners. To aid in biofuel production, you are now capable of removing foliage that consists primarily of wood. Additionally, R&D inflated your pocket dimension. Okay. So we will go for this one next. Because that one's easy. By the time it probably returns, I'll have everything I need for it. So, now that we got solid biofuel, that's gonna be great. 
we can actually start to produce what we need for it. Uh, I do want the chainsaw, because that's going to help me a lot. So let me actually uh, do that real quick. And I just need a uh, bi biomass to be able to produce like 20 times the amount or something crazy. this there's 10 for myself was it five or ten it was five okay uh and i need more screws which i can actually just make go chainsaw acquired and then we can start picking up a lot more resources and get rid of trees like this Probably coming back down so that we can uh, throw these resources in there. Or it did come down already, and I didn't notice. I think it did. Why does this seem slower than usual? This is just a good structure speed? Yes. Okay. I guess because it's further away. And... Each one requires a lot in between each other. a little bit more not for my well for myself and also for the actual machine so hopefully i have enough nope damn it okay okay Milestone reach. Damn it, we have unlocked several structures <laughs> aimed to provide the first needed to build basic All right. factory now infrastructure. Now let's uh let's build that solid overview. biomass thing that Building we're gonna need. We'll provide a grid for more advanced organizing uh, and sectioning. We're gonna need factory. two constructors, if I remember correctly. Uh it's either two or three constructors. We let me build two first. building that little system right here oh my god pet pet 
Uh, I think it's two. So one's for leaves. One's for wood. I mean, uh, I think it's three. I'm sorry. I don't know why I keep saying one to two, one to two. these guys. We're gonna merge them. Okay. Wood in there. Both of them are gonna construct it. Uh, I could have a chest right behind them that has either one. Uh, but actually that doesn't sort between them unfortunately so never mind uh, then we need another constructor in the area uh, I need another host well Those are working. Then I need another constructor. Miner. So we're not going to focus on that. That would be good. But I think we're going to get the assembler first. Actually, you know what? We will focus on this one, but we're not going to throw all the resources we need into it yet. Until I fully finish what I need to do with this. efficient. You can just do it like this. And then... Well, I already have 200. So let me throw it into here. We can then throw the leaves in here. And then the wood in here. And then they can refill it after we're done. There we go. That's really, it's really that simple to make this type of solid uh, biomass storage zone. And it really helps. So now all we have to do is wait for one of our things to run out and then we should be okay. actually spend the resources that I have in my inventory on this. That. Uh, even though I do want to build the space elevator. Okay. 
The map has been unlocked. Milestone reached. The molecular analysis machine, referred to as the MAM, will allow R&D to provide new technologies, items, and buildings based on so the foundation the field. To ensure a greater chance of success during exploration, an upgraded tool belt has been provided, as well as an object scanner and beacons. Good. Note, the object scanner requires calibration via the MAM to enable detection of specific objects. this and then the reinforced iron plates which we have enough for perfect all right ma'am acquired Protein, which is just one constructor, which I need more screws for. Which I think we have enough for, actually. Could be like missing like one, but I think I have enough. All right. So what do we want to focus on next? Probably parts assembly. Because we are going to need the smart chips. I think I have... I have everything for that. I have everything for that. I just need more for... Uh... Copper and the other one. Which... Should I make another copper thingy? Are they too far away? I think they're a little too far away if it's taken that long. Yeah. Thousand meters. I mean, for me, at this point, I can make solid biomass fuel, so I can make more biomass burners and produce higher amounts of iron resources if I wanted to. But I don't really think it's worth it right now. Uh, only because there's so many other things I can do. The only thing that I'm actually producing at a slower rate versus everything is definitely the uh, the screws.
now that we're producing iron plates at such a high level, I'm gonna switch these over to iron rods. Because we need a lot more. These. So I need one more. So I'll look for a guy to take out. Actually, you know, this is only 15 a minute, and he's produced 30 a minute. So I could actually make two more. We do that. And then I can, uh... Use a bunch. Um, reinforce. I need four. Okay. We're gonna switch these back because I just realized that, so I don't need to actually do that. Should have looked at the actual uh, recipe amounts before I switched them. But that did produce a lot of them, which is great. Uh, biomass burners for this, I probably should have checked. there put three to one and then we'll put one to this one how much do I need just ten so I can put another merger with the merger if I needed to no it's not really worth it Consumption that we're taking right now. We should be okay for now. Uh, let's just try to make sure we don't actually uh, go over our amount. Oh, 
because that's fixed. Grab these. Grab these. have a bunch of iron ingots that we can use to build more screws so we don't have to wait too long. Man, every time I play this game, I'm always wise. That's how you know I like the game though. Out. Milestone reached. More complex Tier assembly one of stone. parts can now be automated. Project assembly parts right. can now be constructed and sent up via the space yes. elevator. No. Oh no, I completed it last time. What am I talking about? Complex to produce by uh, hand. Beginning of tier two is done. Uh, now we can make assemblies. Um, assemblies we can actually probably just straight up use for reinforced iron plates. That's the main thing we're going to need for them. So, let's like that one. So, what does this require? Rotors. Which we need iron rods and screws. Okay. make five. I mean four. I can make more of these. That's fine. There we go. Reinforce iron plates afterwards. So we're definitely going to have to expand our screw production by a lot. out our power if we go any higher so we're likely probably should make another burner before we do this uh, where do I want to do this let me check for oh, it's copper I want to do iron let me let me do this on a separate line make this easier on myself there's another guy I can, uh, beat to death. Sir. You weren't supposed to notice me? Get out of here. Thank you. Okay. 
So we're gonna put another miner here. Uh, here, okay. And we're gonna make another zone right over here to actually produce what we need. This here. This here. Uh, sound biomass we have now a lot good that in there I don't need it uh, so we need a sampler I'm gonna use those accidentally doing that produce that this what is gonna be our next one? that one so I want to make iron plates first so after I do that one I'm gonna check out to see for uh, producing anything at a higher quality get that first put that on there Like, I need uh, two constructors for it, directly. I can't remember which type of parts I need for the assembler itself. I'm gonna put it here real quick. Uh, so I need screws, so I need three constructors, two smelters. Pretty sure. power. I knew that was going to happen soon. This is why I prepared this. same time. I'm gonna need more soon, so let me do this. I got trees to cut down, lots of them.
reinforce iron plates. I need six of them. Trying to find space for this space elevator is going to be uh, a little tricky. I'm going to take eight this time. Somewhere up here. Reinforce iron plates. Okay. Now, how much for each? So I need 60 screws per minute. I need 30 iron plates per minute. One produces 20. So I'll need two. Uh, plus a splitter. These ones are iron rods, which is 15 per minute. Screws is 40 per minute. And I need 60, so I need two of those as well. that So I'll need another constructor. And I'm definitely going to need more bombas. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? Throw these 500 flower petals in there. <laughs> I should tie that over for quite a while. When are the fuse break? Consumption really that high. Wow. Okay. Never mind. I'm gonna have to put another one down. Uh, 
15 rods. So I'm pretty sure everything else has power to it directly. Wire. I think I almost have enough for the space elevator as well. There, so I don't run too far. Okay, so we're at 52. And our capacity is 160. So I'm kind of at an impasse here. <laughs> so, can't really do much more than that. focus on this now after all this time everything I need for this technically actually you know what let me put these away because we need 400 of those five hundred of those two fifty of those four hundred one fifty I mean one thousand five hundred which we have 1,000 uh, and uh, almost 500. Okay. Sort that. Cause we need 50 reinforced iron plates. So this is gonna be a little bit. my water on stream and I'm starting to forget how to actually drink water at this point you know it was really strange uh, I was having GPU issues previously with my computer uh that's why the stream was kind of like wonky in the beginning and then uh it was staying at a constant 100 and as the stream has progressed it's dipped down to 50 percent so i'm not sure what happened and uh it's like slowly decreasing
I guess my computer just needed to uh, warm up, I guess. <laughs> Milestone reached. Improved versions of conveyor belts and conveyor lifts are now accessible. To encourage additional verticality, conveyor poles now have a stackable variant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just gonna be that one. Okay. So now I have conveyors at level 2. of each thing you know this is already producing at a pretty high constant rate probably we'll do it with the copper over here first to be honest
sure I have a enough not just production but also uh, production for the other ones which is the name of them. I'm gonna check the wiki again and copper sheets, that's right. So I have to make sure I have enough for that as well. So that's one more I can use for that. Another post. I can't wait till I get these upgraded. Once I can, things are gonna be much easier. Straight into this one, which requires 60. And we're only producing 30 per minute. So I'm gonna put another merger right here. Cable. Actually, I need wire first. So never mind. Wire for that. that up. Okay. This, this. Should 
Okay. Trying to find a post that I could actually use for this is just gonna be ridiculous. more solid biomass quicker so we don't have to worry about it too much um but i am going to upgrade this make this a little bit faster Hold three. I think the max is 200 actually. That's why it's doing that. That should help. Okay. What's my power supply looking like? 90 to 168. Got five in here. Let's go see what the power turn, her, uh, let's go see why the power turned off. Blech. Can't even speak anymore. No fuel for you. Turn it back on. sure how I did that. Okay. I'm 
merger. little bit of a mess. Keep trying to build it backwards and then I'm keep gonna keep running into that issue. focus on stuff we actually need to do. Let me finish this, get the resource sink. Milestone reached. You have been given early access to the anti-waste effort for stress testing of materials on exoplanets bonus program. Funneling parts into the awesome resource sink, depending on their amount and complexity, will grant you coupons in the awesome store, which can be exchanged for bonus rewards. Um, probably want to build it over Examples there, of bonus I think. content are parts, walls, factory attachments, and cosmetics. Fix it is working hard to develop additional options, which will be added to the awesome store in the future. Go that extra kilometer. Go awesome. There we go. Space elevator ready. nearby that I could use. So let me build another rotor, another three rotors. I can actually get the resources from over there. Probably should went over there first. So I have spares. 
Because having to build so much over and over again just takes so long. If I don't have it, like, on hand. Last thing we need to build is jump pads, but we don't have any uh, stem board for it yet. Let's build a few right now. Get reinforced plates right here. So I want separate uh, items per those ones, so uh, what I'm going to do is just like this. I assume this one's also up here, let me double check though. Twitter first and then a merger. Bit it. Not still. What about here? And I do a little. screws on the right side, I mean left side of this one. Hello? Uh, and then I will set up the actual iron rods on the other side. Perfect. I have my game plan. Only issue is, uh, I don't know my power supply. It's, uh, I don't know. It's, uh, Another one down. This is the only thing I don't like is the amount of burners you have to use at the beginning of the game. I can throw all these in there. Need them. I'm gonna need more cable. Grab these guys. Uh, I started from the beginning, 
so I'm actually just trying to work on everything that's created. Uh, I want to be able to start up the first section of the space elevator as well as finish jump pads. So right now I'm working on rotors. Let me get... Portable Miner. Okay. How far have I gotten to the game before? I've gotten all the way to the end. I've beaten the game. Uh, well, quote unquote beaten. I've gotten all the way up to... Uh, the nuclear rods and such. Let's see, I need a smelter. I'm gonna use three. Add a splitter. Probably shouldn't have done it like that, but it's okay. Yeah, I play the I play every game really chaotic. So when I'm doing something like this, uh, it's it's a nice change of pace. <laughs> I'm actually streaming I play the game like way different than I actually do because I when I'm actually playing like a normal game I play it like 10 times slower like my brain works at a different pace Should make 90 screws, so I'll be a little like slower, but not too bad. jump in real quick and see like uh exactly how the game operates and uh i'm stuck uh see how the game operates and see if they want to play it later on so that's why i try and need for speed it the first playthrough and then afterwards i'll slow it down merger Uh, these ones are not going to be iron rods, actually. These ones are going to be screws. And I'm going to merge this one over here to that one. As I said, I want it on the left side.
merge it. that wrong completely. Whoops. No, I mean, that's just one. That should be fine. Um, so I want those two to be able to get to it. I also did want this merger here, so let me do it like this. Since that's a lower angle. Let me see if everything works out. Uh, I probably will play this game again. I really do like this game. Um, and I also want to try and get back to my like original uh, section of how far I've gone through at least halfway through um in the beginning it's usually quite slow in the first place so I think uh after I get a little bit further I'll probably slow it down a little bit more anyway because that it requires a lot more resources once you actually get past this point <laughs> uh we need breaker iron rods Have you ever thought about doing a multiplayer playthrough? Uh, I actually did do a lot of multiplayer previously, and I wanted to actually switch over to something that's more comparable to, uh, my pace. And, to be honest, uh, a lot of my friends, they're quite mean. Um, to say the least. Uh, so I try and, try and focus on what I can do here. focusing so I try and focus on what I can do here and make it as entertaining as possible and not have someone yelling in my ear 24 7 that I'm placing something two degrees off of uh, something else <laughs> enough I don't let it get in my way of actually doing I also just don't want to get angry on stream uh, I've gotten angry a few times and uh, it's usually not a good thing I don't want to be considered a rage uh, gamer I just want to play uh, fun games and try and be wholesome no my power It's probably this one. Angry can be funny. But I'm not funny when I'm angry. Which one went out? These ones, maybe? Probably this right here. Uh, let's those these in here. Okay. Cause I'm gonna need more solid biofuel. I got rotors in production. I 
now I need smart chips. Okay. Oh, can't escape that way. Oh, thank you for the follow. You got some chores and do that? Good luck on my endeavors. Thank you, sir. I hope you jump in on another day. Um. So I think that's everything I need for uh, what I can do, actually. My max consumption is already extremely high. Uh, I'm surprised I'm actually not going over my consumption limit. Um, but if I do, then God damn it, I'm gonna have to build another burner. <laughs> as soon as I finish my sentence, no. like two minutes per so I can only produce two per um which is gonna be quite a while and especially considering that everything that I have so far is also uh, taking a long time to produce so I probably should focus on something different because the last thing we have to build is just jump pads uh, and then we can go to the next phase so I'm going to build those now. I do want to harvest more biomass soon. move all my biomass to a single location so I can just check it constantly if I need to. Probably this one. Yeah. Uh, do I even have any biomass? I don't even have biomass in my inventory and I was checking to see which one was done. Not working. Okay. I wish I could get the uh, roller skates again. Those made things so much easier. Let's see here. 250 max consumption, 247. So, I am right on the crevice of where I need to be.
DNA capsules. Thousand cables. I don't have any of those yet. creatures to beat up. There we go. Milestone and reached. Several buildings and, and a factory traversal can now be accessed in the build menu. Caution is recommended during use of these products. Let me go find some creatures. find some hogs or uh, stingers or whatever they're called oh wait I need this give me that this semi slug seems to emit unfamiliar energy readings which could potentially be retrofitted into fix it technology a new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Perfect. So now I can actually start uh, overdriving my all my equipment. Need to find more of those when I can. I've never seen them so low to the ground. If I had grenades, I can blow that up. So now this is the point in the game where you kind of just run around and collect stuff, see what's here. I do need to get this eventually. It's good it's like right there. Can't actually hurt those guys. I do hear a slug I can grab. I wonder if it's in the cave below me. You can see that elevator from so far away. It's great. You'll never lose where you exactly have to be. Oh god. Almost jumped into a raging river. When you're exploring, you always gotta be careful of, like, 
bosses and such. You can actually see there's a slug up there. I don't know how I'm gonna get him though. Um, because sometimes you'll just run into like a, a random zone and then you'll find yourself caught between like two different bosses and then you're really dead. Like there really won't be much for you to do to save yourself. Knocking me off of the cliff. There he is. He's moving sideways. All right, got one of them. I don't know where the other one went. Oh, there he is. Must have fell off. Oh, don't give me that. This is one of multiple edibles we have detected in your vicinity which are within approved nutritional and medical categories as established by R&D. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. Basically we're just running around grabbing stuff for the MAM that we really need. I don't really, really remember how many I need for the MAM. So I'm just gonna grab a bunch. The mycelia within this fungus suggests strong molecular bonding features frequently observed in adhesives and medicine, both beneficial for field research. A new research tree can now be accessed in the MAM. We couldn't jump over that. <laughs> You can like just barely hear it. It's just the sound of like something like glowing in like a spiral game. Oh no. Let me out. This is one thing you gotta be careful when you're exploring. Uh, you'll sometimes just get stuck. I need to move. Like that. Yep. Okay. Anyway. Do I need 
for that. Well, I got one of these, so I'm gonna research that. A power shard. Oh, wait a minute. That's right. I need to actually find another to get it. I think that's the case. Um, I am going to do that though, because I need to be able to scan them and find them. to the wrong area. There we go. There we go. I need to find one of those. I need to create an overclock. Do that. Can't do that yet. Got one of them, surprisingly. Usually you get a, a bunch of them. So I need another one of those and then I can get the, the rebar gun. Yeah. Okay. We put this away, this way, this way. That's about it. Let's check on how many we got in our assembler. 21. Basically, this is what you're going to be doing 90% of the game uh, when you're not actually producing anything in the factory is just exploring, looking for power slugs. Damn it. What I'm going to do, I'm going to create a ramp. Please, 
Ugh. Okay. Also one this way. Apparently. Oh, there it is. Hacking. Okay. <laughs> uh, there's another one this way. Maybe below. No, it says it says he's above. He's definitely below. I'm not sure what this is talking about. And I don't feel like jumping down there and almost dying. Oh, there goes my power. There's one up there. Let's uh, fix this power issue real quick. Five of them. get up there without having to build perhaps yes there is Try and kill me. Is there another one? never added to this game and I was always expecting them to add is actual pollution levels just like Bacteria did uh, but they just never did it which was a little confusing to me let's 
Because there seriously is another one up there. Let me, uh, let me double check, just to be sure. I didn't see another one. confused. This is probably going to be the last one I'm going to try and grab once I find it. It's on the side of the cliff, right? anywhere but this is there so now I'm just confused There we go about making the reinforced plates. These things are good, I think. Double that production rate, because we're going to need it. 
make these a little bit faster. And then when I find another one, I'm gonna put it for the data symbol. Now, do I want to... Okay, never mind. Let me uh, run out of here as fast as I can. I was going to say, now do I want to die? <laughs> and then I immediately fall... one on radar. My god, there he is, the yellow one too. Alright, let's see if we can get one get him. I do know the power also showed off, I gotta go fix that. See him over there. Okay. Let's head back. I did want a blue one, but, you know, I did get a yellow one, so I can't fully complain. Uh. The yellow one's gonna probably have to be used for the research. Out of range. 
Oh yeah, I see him. Okay. I should just build straight up there and grab him when I get a chance. Alright. Let's see what knocked off the power here. Oh, found it. Uh, let's see all the power zones. Let's see what level they're at. trees over there. Get rid of them. I'm surprised I'm not up to coal, actually. That's the one thing that I was surprised about. I guess these smart plates did take up a lot of my time to try and get up to. Versus, uh, what they did previously, which was just kind of build as fast as I could towards them. Okay. A little bit more and we should be good. then I think I should be able to complete phase one. Okay. Set back. Does my damage me? Did not. Great. Perfect. I think I will definitely play this one again. This one was fun to do. Uh, I also might do Factorio uh, next weekend. I kind of, I kind of want to do some building games. Grab all those. What did I want to build besides that? This right over here. Okay. And that's the last one that I can actually get. For those in there. 
need a bunch of plates, bunch of rotors. Actually, you know, let's focus the rotors first. They're more expensive. that I want to use uh, after I already put these ones in because we need a lot of those screws I need for now. Because once I get coal, things really change very quickly. smart plates build because we need 500 of them that's an insane number now we can make 33 of these about ones so I don't interrupt the other ones and get stuck between two assemblers
I could make a lot of screws manually. So I'll probably do that after this. Man, I'm getting so hungry. I'm definitely gonna eat some food after this. back to the whole streaming with friends things. I have streamed with friends previously. You'll see that in like some of my videos before. Um, it's not that I really dislike any of my friends, it's just, uh, it's more like I want to do my own thing and I don't want other people to dictate exactly what I'm doing. Uh, even if it is the right thing to do. Uh, it's, I don't know. I guess I'm a little prideful in that way. It's also the fact that, like, there's been, uh, there's been a few videos I've had to cut because some people have said some things that aren't, uh, safe for stream. So, <laughs> that's what I've had to do. I have to edit my videos. I've had to cut my streams because of it. So, um,. I guess it's just like, I feel more comfortable doing it this way for now, until I find some other people who do the same thing as myself. And uh, we all understand the rules and the, the TOS and such, because not all my friends stream, and not all of them know all the rules of stream. So. Even if when I created a streaming discord and such, uh, not everyone followed the rules. So. But my regular discord is still up and for people to follow. Milestone reached. Coal is an improved alternative power go. source to biomass and can be fully automated. How far away Provided are water with the new pipeline buildings and power throughout the initial setup. Coal has been added to the resource scanner. That's not good. No. Oh, okay. Ensure the close proximity of water to the coal production um, line. No. Pumps will aid in vertical transport of, so of fluids through way. pipes. No. Throughput and volume indicators are added to each pipe section Let me automatically. Get some miners. Grab some more plates. Water extractors. Oh yeah, I need a. I need to make that other copper section. Looks like my next thing as well. Uh, probably steel. Yeah, probably gonna be steel next. Let me grab some cables. I only have one copper thingy. Um, I think these ones are. Yeah, I could I could change these ones and split them to another section. Could uh, do this. things up and running it's gonna still cost me a decent amount of power so I'm probably gonna have to make another one until I actually get all my power situated 
and then I can slowly phase out these biomass burners. Got in here a lot. Okay, put 200 in there. Let's put 50 in there. Okay. How much for a coal one? 20 plates. Eight of them. So we'll need some more. Two of them from there. And then we'll need ten rotors for per generator, but we'll probably just make one for now. Uh, just to get the basic thing set up for it. set up so let's build a constructor for that Those producing. I need, I need this. Basic steel, I'm gonna finish two of the things that I need for it. Good 
way to check for some power slugs. Oh, I see him. if I even have to go this way. Yeah. Alright, time to fight more enemies. He's still chasing me! What the hell? <laughs> Usually don't chase you for that long. this one These things will be scattered across your map in multiple areas. There's really no actual like direction for them. So you'll just find them like traveling around. I usually find them the first time when I'm actually looking for coal. They usually have some pretty good stuff in them. Let's check it out. Data on the hard drive has been salvaged and can be repurposed to unlock an alternate recipe. Salvaging more hard drives will provide additional alternate recipes. Provide like a direction for myself. Is 
Is the big guy over here or did he walk all the way back? Here, slug. Must be above. Where's it below? There it is. Can't get that one though. I'm gonna go across. I'm not actually gonna go below. Iron plates. Yeah, damn it. Well, let me do this. Because if I go down there, oh, there's actually a slug down there. Damn it. Alright. I'll be back. the research for coal so I mean that counts for something I don't know if he's still up there I'm gonna check because I do want that slug he's up there all right once I get the rebar gun I'll take him out but with this gun with this weapon this thing is really bad against uh, bosses around at the speed of sound. from here to there. It's a little finicky sometimes the building. It's not that bad. I think something just tried to attack me, but I didn't see it. Yellow slug. Which is 
great. I can just grab it doing this. I'm running into some weird glitches right now. I'm not sure if anyone else is noticing it. Probably, probably is. Shoot at me from here. Probably from above. Start making our way down. Okay, okay. Oh, that's fucking horrible. Oh no, that's five of them. Now it's horrible. such a weird battle <laughs> I'm winning I think seen these things anywhere before so we got multiple coal something else is attacking me oh there it is another one oh there's two of them I can't go five feet without being attacked Typical coal zone. research done.
Alright. Don't want to mess with those guys, but there's so many of these guys here for some reason. Uh, because I want to be as close to the water as I can get. Oh, that's a special one. What the hell? I don't want to be hit by that. Yeah, I don't like those special ones because they do so much damage. They do more damage than most bosses. And they'll have like a quick fire if you actually get like near them. Ow. Poison mist. I guess uh, I could get set up though, technically. There's also this thing over here that I come. Let me uh, let me get my power over here. Even though I didn't really need to build it like this, just want to make sure it's all connected directly. Probably just like that, yeah. Let me, uh, let me see what this requires right here, and then I'll get this. Fifty? I think I have enough power for that actually. Oh, it's not connected. Well, apparently I didn't have enough power for it, but I was able to open it anyway. Okay. Let's see if I can take this guy out. These ones are annoying, but I think I can handle them. It's just right. No, nope. and he hit me twice immediately. Hit me one more time, I'm dead. Oh, the poison got him. Ha! Get wrecked. Anyway. Uh, water extractor, I need 20 copper sheets for. So I want to put that miner down first. If I can. Generator. Okay, and connect this up. So, we almost have coal power, but uh, 
I'm over my time. So I'm probably going to head all the way back, and then we're going to end the stream there. And then I'll probably come back to this. Uh, probably Saturday. Or, uh, or I'll keep it consistent and try and do it every Sunday for a little bit. Because uh, I like Satisfactory. It's fun. It's, uh, it's a game you will get used to very quickly. Um, in a way that's like how all the mechanics work. And that's why you saw me fighting five enemies at the same time. And I was, you know, barely breaking a sweat. <laughs> Also, I'm dying of hunger. I'll tell you that right now. I could eat like four hamburgers. Pet. Oh wait, what did I get? Oh, I can unlock these three. Um, probably this one actually, yeah. Either this one or this one, but I'm not gonna get the refinery for a while, and I have another hard drive to scan. So. Well, that's good. I got the alternative uh, one, which is a lot better. I think. I actually don't remember if it's that one or another one. me today i hope everyone enjoyed uh i hope everyone comes back around and watches me longer and more enjoyed check me out on youtube tiktok twitter and check out my discord server uh recommend any sort of game you want me to see um i am thinking of playing a few other games this weekend uh maybe factorio maybe uh enlisted uh i just want to try every sort of game around i want to see what people want to see and i want to see what people like you know um if more people want to see me continue to do what it is, uh, support me. Um, actually, just check me out. Send me in comments. Uh, come interact here on the stream. Um, I know this week I have to work. I don't know if I have to work this weekend. I don't think so. If I do, I might have to reschedule my Friday one. Um, but I don't believe I work. I believe I actually go through uh, my actual, what's it called again? Sales training or whatever. Something like that. Um, besides all that, I hope everyone had a good time. And everyone has a good rest of your day. Peace.